Hello. Let's model this dice. Start a part studio. Create a sketch on the front plane. Center rectangle. Equal sides. Dimension is 16 millimeters. Extrude that symmetric 16 millimeters. Accept that. Hide those planes. Change the appearance to white. And now we all work on those edges, those corners. We need a plane for that with the three points. That one, the bottom one, and that one. All right. Start a sketch on that plane. Project now. Yeah. Project um, some edges, that one, um, that silhouette edge, maybe that one, just to see where we are. Connect these two for an axis, then make a perpendicular line right here. Perpendicular, that one and that one. Oh no, that's the short corner. We we gotta go, go to the other side. Here, there. Perpendicular, that one, that one. Then a three point arc from here to here. Make just one line here to have something to make it tangent to. Make that arc tangent to that line. And make those two parallel. And give that a distance of three millimeters. Accept that. Hide our part, go into the revolve, take that region, that axis, remove from our part, make that visible, accept that. All right. Hide that plane. Make a sketch on the front plane just to have some axis here. That one and that one. And go into the circular pattern mode. That feature, the last feature, axis is that one. Apply parentheses, accept. Then mirror that. Feature, mirror. That one, that one. Mirror plane is top. Oops. No, not top. Mirror plane is right. Accept that. And now we'll make those fillets. Shift F. Point um, four. those edges. Turn around, that one, that one, and that one. Looking good. 
repeat that, fill it with a 0.8 on those faces. Accept that. We can turn to shaded without edges mode. And now let's work on our numbers. Make a plane, offset with uh, four millimeters to the to the inside. Start a sketch on that plane. Project that edge, make a vertical line here, go down, three point arc from here to here to here, and one more line here, and um, some dimensions from that outer side that will be four millimeters and um, the, the arc to that center will be 1.5 right 1.5 and the height will be 0.6 all right those two got to be parallel to get a, a region fully defined. And I just hide the part, makes it easy to pick that region, remove again, shore from all part, make that visible again. All right, hide that plane. And that revolve, let's give it a, an appearance black. Accept that. All right. So now we'll make a linear pattern of that feature. Click it here. And direction one will be defined by that edge. Distance is four and instances is three. Let's um, have the second direction, that one here. Again, four, three, accept that. And now we had that one sketch, right? Sketch three. And there's this axis, or that line, we'll use it as an axis for a circular pattern. So again, a feature pattern, the revolve and the linear pattern. Axis is that one, angle 360, four times, okay. We need um, those dots on those two sides and I want to make another um, circular pattern but we have to get rid of those faces for that and the the feature I like a lot is this delete face with the heel option and you just click those faces accept that and you get it clean. Now we need um, one X again. That is the front plane. We need it on the actually on the right plane. Make a sketch, a line from the origin outwards. Yeah. Accept that. Circular pattern. Again, feature, and 
that will be again the revolve and the linear pattern axis is our axis four times okay all right so we can hide our sketch here and go again actually that's that's our last command for finishing delete face and now i get this dice here on my desk i'll just click for the six these three then to the right is my five i'll click those then here's the four defined like this all right let's turn my dice um delete those one more there is the three here those three and sure enough the one accept that and with this one command oh 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 all right um i forgot that one With well, that one command, we can do all of this work. All right, that's it for the tutorial. I hope you liked it and thanks for watching.